So let's check out this free graphing calculator app. It's called Free Gracalc. Uh, it looks like that. Open it up, and it's got a bunch of tabs down here that we're going to explore. And it's a free graph graphing calculator. So one thing you want to know, uh, you'll notice that there are some ads that will pop up. There's nothing that I've ever seen that's inappropriate, um, but that must be how they pay for the uh, development. But anyway, uh, here is just your basic uh, graphing calculator, but it's also got a lot of tabs here. Here's where you can enter equations uh, so that you can check them out on this graph. And whatever you enter in here is going to output to this graph tab and also to the table right over here. So to change these uh, equations, all you do is come up here, click inside of them. You can clear them out. So I want to do something like x, I don't know, plus 7 x hit save and that will be the red line and then the blue will be the blue line when I come over to my graph one thing I do like about the graph that's kinda cool is you can pinch in and out so you can pinch in to get the uh, more up close look of how it will look um, in this range then you can pinch out to get a higher range or a lower range so I really do like that feature that's kind of a cool way for kids to see it in different ways different perspectives different ranges all right, it also has uh, a reference tab, which is really cool because it's got some things here to help support kids in things, you know, basic definitions and ideas. So if they have trouble with something in algebra, come in here, give you an idea of scientific notation, what exactly it is. There's a quick little thing and then more if you need more help, et cetera, et cetera. And there's a bunch of reference materials. It also has a triangle solver, which I think is kind of cool. So uh, you get in here and you get some ideas. if uh, whatever information you have available to you, you can enter it in here. If you only have two sides, it'll tell you uh, what you have so far. But, oh, I don't have enough information, so enter another side. One inch is longer than the other two combined, so it doesn't work. So I like that. Pretty cool. Come in here, I'll just get one that it can actually function. Okay, so it gives you the triangle. It gives you the angles, and you can do it the reverse way, too. So you can add information here. Let's say I've got a 75-degree angle. This side is 20, this side is 12. It'll fill in the rest of the information and give you the area. Now there's other things here that you can play around with. Polynomial solvers, you hit, if you click on more, it gives you some more things that kind of fluff settings. You can buy the full version, um, things like that. But the free version has a lot of functionality to it. So there